Hi guys, um, Brian here from Canada. We're doing a little HHO experiment with my son Lucas. Uh, good thing the wife's not here, we'd be in serious trouble. Anyhow, I've got uh, the cell here. It's sitting in, <laughs> in the sink. And we're drawing about uh, five and a half amps. I uh, don't know if you can see that or not. If not, uh, you'll just have to take my word for it. I really don't have any idea what the cell is putting out as far as liters per minute at the moment. Um, but anyways, the what I wanted to show was, and you guys probably already know all this stuff, but anyways, this is a Sport Cat, Coleman Sport Cat catalytic heater that I had from camping um, and I had hooked it up originally uh, through this valve and when I did it that way I didn't get any flashback occurrences but I don't know how hot I had gotten it. Um, so this time I took it apart, took this valve out of the equation because what was happening is I was getting pressure buildup in this tank and uh, it was ballooning my tank to the point where it looked like it was going to um, leak or explode or something. So anyhow, some people might consider this reckless, but I've got a very small cavity in here so when we do get flashback, uh, the explosion is limited to a very small area. We had a, a little flashback occurrence about 10 minutes ago uh, that blew the top right off the, um, right off the canister there and we had a pretty interesting explosion. Anyways, this uh, little meat thermometer I have in here, when I do it this way, it is, it climbs steadily, um, takes a long time for it to climb. But when we had flashback, it was uh, between 160 and 150, I believe, when it flashed back last time. So this part alone won't um, uh, defend a, against any sort of flashback. But this valving unit might help, I'm, I'm not sure. So what I plan to do is get a vessel that will handle a little bit of pressure so that I can uh, continue to put air into it and see how high the temperature actually goes if it just keeps continuing or if this unit will flash back as well. Um, it's a really tiny orifice in there so but the interesting part is it doesn't seem to stop climbing it climbs and continues to climb um, with the same amount of output. So anyways, I just thought I'd share that with you. Um, you probably know it all already, but uh, interesting nonetheless. Thanks guys, we'll talk to you soon. Cheers.